Austin police also investigating after a suspected burglar was found dead inside a building in downtown Austin. Cops say that man had tried breaking into a home in that area, but the resident was able to fend him off using pepper spray. Fox 7's John Krinjak live downtown with more on what happened here. John. Yeah, Mike, that man's body was located on the 12th floor of this building here behind me. And while Austin police have not revealed exactly how he died, it may have been due to cuts from broken glass. APD officers finding the body of a burglary suspect in a downtown office building Sunday night. It's a crazy story. Very scary. Yes. Around 6 p.m., police got a call from a home on 6th Street that had been broken into. Officers responded. It was a residence where the glass was broken and a uh, suspect attempted to go up the steps. He was confronted by the um, residence owners of that residence. He was pepper sprayed. The suspect fled the scene on foot and ran to an office building on 7th Street between Brazos and San Jacinto. He again broke through the glass window there. Cops were able to track him down using security video and tips from the public. Got calls from a uh, citizen stating um, bloody pr footprints were following throughout the city. Um, up to this location. Officers made their way inside, going floor by floor to try and find him. Making sure that there's no innocent people um, harmed here. Unfortunately, found him um, lying on the, the 12th floor. Despite efforts to revive him, the man was pronounced dead at the scene. Whether it was from the glass that was he was cut or how that um, he became deceased is unknown to us. Security expert Ashley Raymond says the resident who was initially burglarized absolutely did the right thing. Just knowing how well pepper spray does work, I was really glad that the resident was confident enough to know how to use the pepper spray and to act quickly, right? Raymond, who heads up Safely Self-Defense here in Austin, says pepper spray can be an important tool in defending your home as well as yourself. And what happens is when you spray the pepper spray and it causes an instant reaction to where they're shutting their eyes, they're in a ton of pain and it lasts anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. But it is important to know how to use it. We tried out a device okay. using water. Okay. Unlock it first. Okay. And then you'll aim. So say we're aiming you know, at this car right here or something. Yeah. You'll press down and you'll think eye to eye. So it'll go like that. Perfect. Eye to eye. Okay. <laughs> That's easy. That's easy. Now, Raymond stresses that with any potential intruder, every situation is different. Meanwhile, if you have any information on what happened last night, you're urged to give Austin police a call. Reporting downtown, I'm John Crinjack, Fox 7 Austin News.